I'm seeing things I shouldn't see. I'm dreaming things I've never seen. You're beginning to think in images, concrete images. Hey guys, hey internet, it's Ink Eater, and welcome to BAM, Vinyl and Music News, where sometimes we talk about vinyl, music, and sometimes music news. Tonight, I was actually going to talk about the little tiny sounds that you like in music. And then that turned into like the most time consuming process ever because I don't know about you, there are several songs that I like where there's little tiny sounds and I wanted to showcase that. And if I was going to do it justice, I figure let's leave it off for another week. So tonight, instead, we're going to talk about what makes you like a song. Is it the beat? Is it the lyrics? Or is it the artist? Um, I don't know. Recently, I was opening up Spotify and I was looking at um, my new Radar playlist, um, which is a thing on there. There's um, new releases, I think, and then your new music Radar, um, like music that gets suggested to you that you might like. And it's kind of interesting how sometimes um, a certain artist name will pop up on there and I will just gravitate towards the artist. Or sometimes I'll just let the damn thing play out and I will just gravitate towards the beats, not realizing who I'm listening to. And it's kind of been interesting um, from month to month, just like playing this game of, okay, I'm not going to look at my phone. I'm not going to look at what's actually playing. I'm just going to listen to it. Do I really like it? Or is it because of the artist? What am I being influenced by? I think all of us at some point or some time, some point or another in our lives has been influenced by something, whether that's a commercial that you see that you really love that song that it's in, or, um, for instance, that Gene commercial or that new Apple commercial. Um, I think we all kind of gravitate towards a certain type of music, especially if we hear it enough times. And it kind of got me thinking, you know, what drives you to like a certain type of music? Is it the beat? Is it the lyrics? Is it the artist in general? Um, for me, I want to say if I'm not influenced, it's usually the beat and the lyrics. Um, and then if I'm slightly influenced, it's totally the artist. As of recently, it's been the artist because I'm like, ooh, they're creating a new music. Ooh, they're creating new music. Is it just me or have you noticed that a lot of these artists are coming out of the woodwork that you haven't heard in years? And they're like, hey, come listen to my stuff. But then again, it's kind of like an interesting world in terms of um, just being a creative entrepreneur, I guess. Um, and especially since it's kind of like free reign so to speak, considering the world that we knew no longer exists in a sort of type of way. If you want to be eerily creepy like that. Anyway, story for another day. But it kind of got me thinking, you know, what is it that drives you? Um, for me, like I said, it just happens to be the beat and the lyrics. Unless you have me on Spotify. And then I see, ooh, Jack Johnson made a new song. And then I'm like, oh, yay. <laughs> anyway, um, let me know down in the comments below what drives you. Whether it's the lyrics, the music, um, beats, um, or the artists themselves, I would really love to know. Anyway, I hope you guys are doing awesome, and if you missed out on yesterday, we talked about Carbon Ink. I'm in love. Um, I don't have to use as many ink pens, which is kind of awesome. Um, and in case you're curious about that and you like the art nerdy talk um, in a little bit of a way, I will leave a link to that down below. If that's not your jam, then no worries. Um, subscribe if you like, and, um, and oh, before I go, um, please join us on, um, Saturday if you like live streams. I'm trying to be more talkative, especially since I figured out the ability to talk while drawing at the same time, while also simultaneously keeping music, <laughs> um, when there's a lull. Um, yeah, that's a thing. Um, anyway, join us. Um, and if you want to actually participate in who we draw next, um, I'm going to be posting the poll tomorrow at 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time um, on Instagram stories if that's your thing and you'd want to choose who we draw next. That's kind of how we choose it anyway. Um, definitely, um, I will leave a link to that down below. And in case you're curious, it's just at Ink Eater. Um, anyway, I hope you guys are doing awesome. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Bye. Whatever it is that you believe you're seeing, it's not, 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 not real. Seeing things before they happen. Things are not always what they seem in this place. So you can't take anything for granted.